Hola, minasan! Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back for another round of freelance gaming. We're on the second leg of three straight uh, roster runs, and today it is Melty Blood. Melty Blood. Type Lumina. Lumina, 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 Lumina. That's right. We're going to Vampire Land. We're going to Vampire Land plus uh, plus Fate Stay Night uh, guest. <laughs> uh, where's my where's my chart here? Here we go. My little tracker chart here. Uh, can never trust the uh, can never trust the computer to keep track of your wins and losses. Yep. So, how y'all doing today? I hope y'all are doing great. I hope y'all are having a great time. I hope, I hope you had a good weekend. I know I have. What a beautiful weekend. Woo! You want to talk about a beautiful sky with a nice uh, with a nice sun, you know, shining down on you. You feel the warmth of the sun, the cool breeze of the air, that nice beach air. Yeah, that was good. And then the rain came. <laughs> the rain came. It came and rained down all day today, sort of, kind of. Well, it's still sunny. No, no, not sunny. It's still cloudy. Who knows? Point is, the point is, the weekend was sunny and breezy and nice and beautiful and good. And I'm itchy because I got bit. <laughs> I got bit all over the place. I'm scratching behind the legs. I'm scratching on the arms. I lack the mosquito repellents. Oh man, uh, I don't know what this bug is. We got like some kind of weird bugs uh, um, I've never seen before uh, in my neck of the woods. I guess uh, it's a new invasive species. Just casually climbing up my leg, and I was like shaking my leg, shaking my leg, like yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to flick it off, and then it just stood there <laughs> on the ground, twiddling. <laughs> it wasn't moving, wasn't flying or right anything. It just stood there, almost like like. Like saying, what's wrong? <laughs> like, yeah, so. <laughs> uh, I was like, I was like, tukut garacha, eh? <laughs> Even though it's not a cockroach, I don't know what it is, but we got these weird bugs going on in my neck of the woods. So, anyway, so today is a roster run. Which was already noted before, so I don't know why I'm repeating it. I don't know. I need help on this one. <laughs> I need help here, people. <laughs> I'm repeating myself. <laughs> I'm repeating myself. <laughs> so, gonna play uh, Aoko Aozaki, uh, the latest uh, um, DLC character. Um, the latest DLC character from Multi Blood Type Lumina. There's supposed to be new DLCs. Um, I got lucky. I got one of those. Uh, uh, I was able to get uh, Multi Blood, um, where you get DLC for free. I think you know, as a reward. So you know, it's supposed to be a free download the next fighter or something. But um, I don't know who the next fighters are. I, I was trying to. Uh, I, I looked at the website. They didn't announce um, who the next fighters were going to be. I don't know. Um, maybe I looked at the wrong spot. Who knows. I mean, maybe I could check, but uh, you're just wasting your time here because you want to get to the point. But <clears throat> nevertheless, I, I had hoped that um, they would have um, had the new DLC ready uh, for the next run, but they don't, so it's okay. It's not a big deal. We could still do the roster run and just wait for the next one. Well, wait until next time. Like seriously, who is the next DLC? <laughs> yeah. Oh, here we go. Yeah. See, they haven't mentioned when the next one is gonna happen. The last uh, DLC was uh, April 14th. Um, and the last full update was May 26. What was May 26? Yeah. Just adjustments. Um, just taking a quick look here. Yeah. So that's the situation. We're still waiting. Hurry. Hurry. <laughs> Alright, well, let's not waste too much time and let's get to the roster run. <laughs> okay, so you all see the quests up there? Um, I've been uh, debating in my brain uh, whether I should start listing out previous roster runs. 
Uh, I've been making, I, um, I made the first list for Blade Strangers, and you know, I still got a few, well, a handful of games Ultra Street Fighter 4, Street Fighter 5, this game here, and uh, the Guilty Gear games, and a few more. Because uh, I was debating if, um, if revealing the previous records would deter you guys from uh, watching the roster runs, and I was like, are they gonna really, uh, are they gonna really sit down and watch um, the, the, all the old roster runs? If they come in here, I mean, they probably want to see it live more so than anything else. Um, you know, I, I keep the game. Uh, you know, I don't edit these uh, roster runs, so you could so it could be legit. You know, saying so see it legit from um, from start to finish. But I don't know. Um, I'm, I'm still up in the air. But I'm gonna give it. Um, but I'm just gonna give it one shot, and that's going to be uh, in the quests, as you can see on the list. Uh, the best record of, um, of Melty Blood Type Lumina. So, um, that's the best record uh, overall between all the fighters, which was just only Arcoid. Uh, I played on her twice because I had a little uh, rule regarding roster runs that it has to be a complete roster, but I thought uh, Melty Blood was not going to get any more, uh, get any fighters from the way it looked, but that shows how much I was paying attention. <laughs> Uh, so I decided to just loosen up and, and not worry about um, and be rigid like that because I wanted to do roster runs of every possible fighting game that has a versus mode um, with a versus computer which is the most important thing is that versus computer part because without the versus computer part in the versus mode uh, there are no roster runs because <laughs> that's the fun thing if you're wondering why I'm twiddling around it's because I'm a twiddly person I'm a twiddly I'm very twiddly, so mm, you know, <clears throat> it's just uh, that's just the way I am, cause you know I got, cause I know a million people, less than that anyway, <laughs> are watching these videos uh, on the uh, in the world stage of uh, Twitch and YouTube, so you know it's it's just a little it's just a little nervousness, you know, what I'm saying not, not but accustomed to being uh, stared at. That's why I keep my arms crossed. <laughs> trust me, trust me, it's for the best, uh, you know, for me personally. Uh, but uh, yeah, so got uh, this roster run. Uh, we got one more to go, and then I'll be jumping on over uh, to Toho Hiobana, uh Antinomy of Flowers, as the Sakura Petals Ball. <laughs> Such a crazy title. I know I added to that title, but it's just it's just that antinomy of flowers. It's so poetic. <laughs> it's being so poetic about it. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna do a deep dive of that. So that's uh, that's on the queue for the next two weeks, and I'm gonna figure out where to go from there. Um, uh, where to go from there? So I don't want to make too too many announcements ahead of time because uh, I only do these once a week. The the fighting games. So we gotta try to figure uh, figure that one out. I'm almost done with uh, Koki Santo Hiragana. I think I got like what four more episodes, four or three more, four, four. What episode did I go up to? Great. But uh, but uh, how many more episodes do I have to go? Uh, yeah, four more episodes. Four more episodes of uh, Koki Santo Hiragana. That's four more weeks. In fact, that would be the rest of this month. Yeah. Yep. So this is the month that um, Koki Santo Hiragana will be uh, retired, the title, and will become Koki San Freelance Gamer um, on Wednesdays, which means that I will be bringing uh, Japanese gaming into the fold uh, under Koki San uh, Freelance Gamer, which means there will be Japanese language live streams under the banner of Koki Santo. Uh, uh, of Koki san freelance gamer so it's not going away you know, you know like i said japanese language let's plays it's gonna happen it's just gonna be under the banner um along with all the other amenities that go with uh, the japanese live stream all right i think that's it that's it so you know please don't be strangers you know you know if you if you like the if you like this channel and everything else you know you know please you know just select that follow button and subscribe button on twitch and you know and if uh if you're over on youtube you know select that subscribe button and, and that like button and throw in a, co a comment or two you know 
and you know, throw a comment or two over. And, uh, you know, join me in the chat. If you're in the live streams, please join me in the chat. Inquiring minds like to know. Inquiring minds want to know. They all want to know. Now nah, I'm just mumbling at this point. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> it's all mumbles. Okay, let's get the run going here. So, let's reiterate the rules. Go into versus mode. We select versus CPU. We make sure the game difficulty is at its highest, and that is five for Melty Blood type Lumina. See, this is the easiest, and this is the hardest, and that's it. That's all you got to do. That's it. And then you jump in. You select uh, player one side. And here we go. Hmm. Let me put the volume on just a little bit. Hopefully it won't create an echo. <laughs> here we go. Just uh, just for my end here. So I can hear the nice little TV. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. And if you guys like reading books, you know, don't, don't hesitate to uh, go over to Amazon.com or BarnesandNoble.com and get yourself a copy of The Impossible Man, a strange fantasy novel. It's a funny book. You'll like it. I know you'll love it. You will love it. So, yeah. Just head on over to the, uh, to the links in my about page on Twitch or down in the description in my YouTube page. And, uh, you know, and uh, have fun. All right, so we have a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen fighters. We've got eighteen fighters, so it's going to be a bit of a run here. Yeah, you can really tell that the uh, um, two slots down at the bottom is the next two fighters. That'll make it twenty. Dang, I would have liked to have done twenty fighters for a roster run. Oh well, it's all good. So, you select the, the fighter you're gonna uh, run with. And today it's Aoko Aozaki and her rockin' awesome white t shirt and jeans. It's like some Terry Bogart levels of, uh, of uh, fighting here. I mean, look at, the, look at those shoes of hers. And those aren't even sneakers. <laughs> those aren't even sneakers. Awesome design. Very awesome design. And then you uh, start from. Uh, you start pretty much from anywhere you want to, but I always go left to right, all the way down to the bottom right. So from Parchiel down to Red Arquid, 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 Arquid. I never could pronounce that name right. Arquid, Arquid. Dang it. Arukawai. I know it's supposed. To, I know in Japanese you're pronouncing it as Alucard. Uh, <laughs> it's supposed to be pronounced as Alucard. Uh, but, oof, man, auto, dang you English. <laughs> yeah, so, and also try and keep out, um, keep an eye out. Some, uh, some fighting games do have hidden fighters, um, that are hidden in the, uh, in the character select. So make sure you add those as well and do your mirror modes. So that means that we'll have, uh, a mirror match between Aoko and Aoko. So yeah, that's, uh, that's the run and just get as many wins as you can. In, the, in this whole entire uh, playthrough. <laughs> so, our first opponent is Power Chiel. Um, honestly, I'm not a big fan of these mirror, you know, these um, copy, copy paste characters. Especially this. I think this was a travesty. Having them not only separated, but also together. I think that was, that was lazy. That's my opinion. Very lazy. Because look at, look at, you got Noel, and then you got Noel here. You got Xiao, and then Xiao here, then you got Hisui and Kohaku together, and then they have them separated. That's this is this is a slot that could have been filled with a with a completely different fighter. And you know, this is like how many slots we're talking here? One, two, three, four slots. That's four original fighters that could have gotten in here. Come on. Four fighters that could have had. But hey, what can we do? Okay, and I don't do random, um, I don't, oh, I never even noticed that, the training stage is blocked off, good. Hello, Jody Star, welcome to the show, welcome to the chat room. Jody 
and Sai wakes up on the ship. Greetings. You are with the Sky Pirates once again. <laughs> okay, gathering of old blood. Background music is auto. That's fine. There we are. Runtime. <laughs> Did I get her? Yes! Blew up the earth! Got her. What? No, you are not held captive, Jody Star. Have some grog. <laughs> It is the drink of kings. Ah. Dang, gotta close that gap quick. She's owning me out. Oh! <laughs> Dang! You blocked that. Got me. Hmm. That was a big mistake, now I'm getting punished. Ah! Ah, oh, dang. Oh, man. That me on. Mm. Oh, she went aggro. Blast all that shielding. Zoner. Oh. Dang it, I was going to try to zone around. That screwed up. The star of the show, Arquaid. Arquaid? Quaid. 
Get back down there. Oh, she was like, no, get up there. Oh. Oh, I wanted to give her that cardio. <laughs> no. Oh. Get back there. Mm. Oh, she got past that. Ah. Uh. Oh. Dang it. <laughs> I can't believe you did that. Oh! Got him. Yes, the life of a pirate is yours, Jody Star. <laughs> Up. Yeah, I screwed this one up. Uh, I screwed that one up. I decided to go for the heat, and I, I, I got punished for it. I deserve that loss. That that was definitely not on me. Yeah. この子、私と被ってない。よろしくお願いします。オープンユはマジックサービス。ファイト。取りの。マジックで。飛び込みシンプルです。裏だ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ。やめ
É, cara. Não, não, isso vai come to mind, uh, Jody Star. Eu não. Ah! Oh, it's like I'm gonna have to zone her out then. Alright. Alright. I zoned her out. <laughs> I'll take it. Alright, got the first win. Oh no, not a shipwreck. Ah, oh, and the shipwrecks. <laughs> Is it just me, or is this game starting to look more and more like Skullgirls? It's like four dudes here. Oh, five dudes. Sorry, Mario. I forgot about Mario. But still. I gotta play Skullgirls. I gotta get into that one. I mean, I have Skullgirls, but I'm just waiting for these DLC characters to show up. It's not enough fighters to really do a genuine roster run. I learned that the hard way Battle Fantasia. Whoa. <laughs> Oh. oh, I screwed that one up. I'm punished. Oh, got him in the face. <laughs> I really like her um, arc drive. Her arc. Her life arc. Punch. I've never seen a character punch a, a magic circle before <laughs> and make and make a beam of light fly out there. in the middle of the moon drive uh, I was about to start up the old move my magic circuit I mean all right oh. Mm. oh man I'm playing too defensively right now Are you serious? He just countered that? Oh! 
Jody Star says the ship's going down. No, it's still falling. And it will never stop falling again. <laughs> Joey Star says, I mean, we're going to crash. Indeed, we are crashing. Right into that volcano. <laughs> oh, not the volcano. Momentary visitor. All right. Dang, man, he got. He had those mid attacks. Couldn't block those. I needed to jump. All right. Let's see what to do with these two. Mm, hit me with a chair, freaking wrestler. Yeah. You gotta like really be aggro with um. Oh, I messed up there. <laughs> I punched your sister. <laughs> that was hilarious. I was like, punch. Knock <laughs> them both out. That's hilarious. Ow. Mmm. I says pushes off pushes Bradley off the ship. Aha, I am a dragon. I fly. Yeah. Then go down the ship. Ha <laughs> so I watch you fall. <laughs> Alright, it's time to tie this. <clears throat> どなたか存じませんが、ここで倒しておきますね。あ、指揮から私のこと聞いてる感じね。
Oh. Take that. <laughs> Oh, ho, 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 got the cross punch. <clears throat> oh, Jody Star falls on the beach while the ship falls in the water. Three point landing, hero style. What are you, Vega? Hmm? Your claw? Get out of there. Dude, it's Jody Star. Check out the sun. It's totally bright. Dang it! Okay. Three. No, no, no! Oh! Did I get it? Time over. Ho oh, ho. Oh, oh. That was close too, because uh, <laughs> that chip damage almost got me there. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good. Dude. That's a lot of sand. Is that a castle you made out of that? Oh, 
Dang it. Oh, I didn't finish that up. There we go. Get all that uh, damage back. <laughs> Gaining back light. Got the arc <laughs> Got him. <clears throat> Dude, let's climb the sand mountain. Let's see what's at the top. Alright, time for the second row. Off to a good start, four and three. Dad Apostle Noel. Midday coincidence. I think not. Look at the ocean from all the way up there. Dang, got ripped apart. <laughs> I like how Aoki, uh, Aoko is smiling. <laughs> She's just laying on the ground. Like, ah. <laughs> yeah, 
her zoning is insane. Couldn't even get close. Start check out all the waves down at the mountain. It's like splashing and such. It's time to surf. There's a lot. This is a very zone intense game. He looks sad. <laughs> He's like, I'm sad. All that energy out. Woo -hoo, look at that damage. Got him. <laughs> Woo, that was good. Yeah, nah. <laughs> I got a knock there. Oh, he threw some icicles. Oh, oh he's making like uh, a kill in Street Fighter Five. Went with the fire, now he's going with the ice. Oh. <laughs> Dang. Wow, I just got torched. He didn't like that I beat him that way. <laughs> he didn't like the way I, uh, I took him out. And he's still sad. He's like, so sad. <clears throat> wow, man. Blob just ripped me apart. That stinks. <laughs> Dang, man. He switched from fire to ice. It was like, no. Or maybe he was teasing me. He was like, he was like hustling. Destiny's entrance. <laughs> that's the new. That's the new all boy band. You heard of? Destiny's Child, now here's Destiny's Entrance. Anata, Stoto, you yori singak sajanai? Mukashino Hanashida. Ima wa konotori outro de me. Open you a magic Oh, he got that cross up. <clears throat> oh, he got that nigga. Whack 
me in the face, bro. Woo! I won that battle. Ugh. Oh no! Oh, I can't believe it. <clears throat> Dang it. And he got all of his health back on top of that. There we go. Ah! Oh my gosh, this dude freaking... Oh! Dang it. Great. <clears throat> After making all that headway. This one, this was, this was bad. Hmm. Do I have to death stare now? Dang it! There we go. Had to do it. Gotta get around. <laughs> wow, that was a crazy glitch, and I got very lucky there. I 
don't know why he's walking backwards for. I'll just have to zone him out. There we go. That was weird. I don't know what happened with the computer there. The CPU. Well, I'll take it. Wow, what a reach. I did all the wrong things. Zone her out. <laughs> That's it. Zone her out. <laughs> She's got a nice shirt there. That, that black one. Um, that black shirt. Hmm. 
Wow. I got pinned in. There we go. Come on! Oh, now you decide to... Okay, now well, you gave me the hit. Alright, last row. Five fighters. Five fighters. Yako Arima. This little shrimp. <laughs> to the Crimson Chapel. Ooh, can I run the table? Oh, that would be awesome if I could run the table. Praise the sun. We got her life back. No, that was a... Oh, she finished. Oh, I screwed up. Yep. Ah, I messed that up royally. I should have won that. That, that was no excuse. Oof. Oh, the computer's like, uh-uh. I'm ending you right now. I'm not giving you any chances here. <laughs> Punch her in the face. Punch her in the stomach, and now I'm unleashing the powers of... <laughs> ...of the stars. There we go. I'm just 
gonna zone you out. <laughs> Oh, she broke my perfect. Done. <laughs> Maybe I should have leaned into that. Just zone out all the all my opponents. Now nah, that probably wouldn't have worked anyway. All the time. Oh, now I gotta do now I gotta deal with these maids individually. Three straight maids. Take her on to the summer sky. Take her on take her on the summer sky. <laughs> On me, jeez, and then drop the earth. Gosh, it's like taking on Tacey in uh, Waku Waku 7. this round. Oh, she got around that. Yo.
Five game winning streak. Nice. Five wins in a row. Time for Seba and her Faith Stay Night. Magician's Knight X. ショクログではこの辺りもあ、あ、その店知ってる終わったら行きましょうオープンはマジックサーキットファイトこれなら行こうせいやこれでいいだろうだけ何のサウザーおいなこれ Got her. Last star. Got the arc drive. I keep saying last star. <laughs> it's arc drive. Arc drive finish. Hello, XR3PT4RX. Welcome. Welcome to the live stream. Ah. There we go. You are witnessing a roster run. The rules are very simple. I am taking on the entire roster in versus mode. And I'm trying to get as many wins as I can at the highest difficulty. Ah! Got wiped out. Reptar. <laughs> ah, so you your name is pronounced Reptar. Reptar it is. Mm. Ah. Oh, ah. Dang it. Came in with the mid hit. Got her. Ha <laughs> ha. Last arc. Yeah, she's got so she's got some mean moves, Aoko. I'm really liking her. Ah, ah. Uh. Oh no. After all that. No. Dang it. Dang. Yeah, that's one of the drawbacks of Switch. Not a lot of online fights. <laughs> Have you tried doing um, the tutorial to uh, to learn the game? It's pretty. Um, the tutorial's pretty good. Battle at the threshold. Ah, uh, uh, do uh, Reptile says, do you think they will be releasing more male characters eventually? Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm hoping so. I was like pointing that. It was funny. I was pointing that out earlier, uh, um, early in the stream. It, um, it feels like um, it feels like Skullgirls right now. <laughs> Not that it's a bad thing. Skullgirls is a pretty awesome game. <laughs> But it does feel like a but it does feel like skull girls right now. <laughs> I 
Throw a giant shiitake at me. Ugh. Uh. Keep your picnic to yourself. There we go. Got her. Oh, she blocked that. With a freaking tray. Oh, Dang it. What is this, Earthbound throwing, uh, throwing the, the lamp at me? I'm gonna have to zone this. I need the win. There we go. So I surpassed uh, the game um the game record. Yes. One more fight to go. Not bad. This is my best run yet. <laughs> Spam Lamal. Whatever works. Precisely. Whatever works. Whatever works. <laughs> if done right, if done right, her freaking zone just man just dominates. It's pretty crazy. Last fight. Red Arquide. Or is it Arquade? I can never pronounce her name. Arquide? Ar Arquade? Ar <laughs> it's so tough. Arquide? Arquade? Quade. Start the reactor. I don't know, I haven't tried out Mario yet. I haven't tried out Mario yet. Arcweed. 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 Hmm. Arcweed. Someone will eventually show up, scream at me, be like, It's pronounced this way! <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm punished. Ah, oh, I hate the aggro. Dang. Jeez. <laughs> Some super weed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right in the face. Wanna wanna lean a little bit more? Hmm? Oh there we go. Oh. Ow. Oh no, she's gonna come back on me. Ah, uh, I need to. 
Okay. Ah. Uh, you know what? I deserve this. I had total control of this match. I, I deserve that loss. I, I deserve that. I don't know why. What was going through my head? I should have just finished her off and gone into the next round. I don't know what was going through my head. I was trying to show off. That's what was going through my head. I wanted to do a freaking the uh, last arc instead of just freaking taking around. That's on me. That's on me. Ugh. Could have gotten, could have gotten 11 wins out of this. Oh well. Yep. That's my. So that's the final. That's the final tally. 10 and 18. 10 and 8. 10 wins, 8 losses. The most excellent run. Well, I wouldn't say excellent run. Excellent run would be would be having maybe five losses, and less, uh, five, uh, one to five losses. That would be an excellent run. This this was an improvement. This is an improvement. There we go. <laughs> yep, that's an improvement. Oh, that's an improvement. I just hope they could get some more fighters in here. Would like to have a little bit more than that. So that's it. Ten and eight. That's the roster run. So that's the new record. Hey, I gained nine thousand CPs. All right. Oh man, this was uh, that was good though. This was a good run. This was a good run. I screwed up at the end. I had Arc with the uh, Dead Dead to Rights. Right there, I should have won that second round, but I wanted to be a show off. I wanted to be a show off, and I paid for that. I should have just just finished it and gone into the third round, and then show off. <laughs> um, um, CP lets me go and buy in the gallery, I believe. It's in game currency. Yeah, current CP thirty-four thousand nine hundred. Could buy all these. By these illustrations and such, it's, you know, that's for the diehard of diehards. Yeah, that's all for the diehard of diehards. If, if anybody wants that, but yeah, um, yeah, this was uh, that was it. That was it. What a, whew, what a, what a good run. Definitely, definitely got torched. Uh, Got torched in a couple of matches. Roa definitely torched me. I didn't even. <laughs> He's just going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It was insane. Who else? Uh, who else was uh, driving me nuts here? Let's see here. Let's reflect on this here. So yeah, Flav just Flav switched up. He went from from fire to ice and just wiped me out in the third round. And Roa, <laughs> Roa just went all over the place on me really took me to town I should have won this that, that that was a match that I should have won and I screwed around on this one that that's on me I should have known better I should have known better but I'm still I, I'm just I'm still hung up on the fact that they put two characters they, they put in two characters in one slot and then they separated them in two two different slots this could have been this could have been a whole different fighter this could have been a whole different fight. This was just so unnecessary. I'm still hung up on that. I think this this was this was a bad choice for a roster uh, to put in the roster. That could have been that could have been a character, a good one, a really fun one. Yeah. And this one, whew, boy, she zoned me out. Just kept throwing those spears at every every possible angle. I couldn't even get close. And I couldn't even zone her. She, I got out zoned. So those were the, those were the results. Mm. So you know what? I don't know. You still there, reptile? It's hard to tell. I'm just hanging now at this point. <laughs> hey. hey, hey, hey. 
Life, life is treating me good. Life always treats me good. Because I grab, because I grab it by the shirt and I put my fist up and say, "You gonna, you gonna treat me good, life. You gonna treat me good." And life be like, "No, no, I don't treat you good. I treat you good." That's how life treats me good. <laughs> Venom Fang, welcome, welcome. You just missed the run. I just finished the roster run. <laughs> you are late. You are late. Ugh. Oh, gotta get here quick. <laughs> so I'm just basically in hangout mode at this point here. <laughs> so got Reptar, got Venom Fang. Welcome guys, welcome. Glad y'all could make it. So Reptar. Reptar, you don't know how to play this game, so I'm gonna, gonna do uh, do a couple of uh, tutorial stuff here. I don't know if you played the tutorial, but maybe maybe I'll help you out a bit here. We'll start with the life gauge. <laughs> That's one of the things I found funny about the tutorial. <laughs> How do you get the display moves on the bottom? So, what I do um, what I do is I go into Microsoft Word. Um, I was able to find, um, you know, icons like um, A, B, and C and such, and I just go, in fact, you know all that, okay, you know all that. So what are you having a hard time with, Reptar? Why am I not getting out of here? Mm. A menu. So... Let's see here. Yeah, let me switch over here. Let me switch over here. I'll demonstrate. I'll demonstrate. Let me make sure. All right. Let me get this up. No, 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 no. I don't want to reveal the behind the scenes, uh, too much of the behind the scenes stuff. Let's see here. Ah, here we go. Let me get this up. And let's scroll this down. There we go. All right, here we go. And now. <laughs> Sorry, it's but it's kind of smushing my screen here, I see. <laughs> Yeah, the auto combo. Um, I've been trying to. Uh, I was trying to find uh, through um, through the options how to turn off the auto combo, so that way I could combo uh, all on my own. But um, apparently, it's uh, apparently I can't find it. <laughs> so let's see here. Okay, so, uh, let me, you know what, let me go to Mario, throw him up on here, random, oh wait, did I go, yeah, I'm in the tutorial, right, yeah, here we go, so I just simply go right into the command list, focus on the special attacks, just like that and then as you can see up here and go on my uh, spider bomb characters so I got the little icons here and then what I do is here we go here's a uh, oh, cool. so I just replace the name let's see what's his name it's just Mario Super Mario so I just type in Mario and then I just put in the names of the special text so let's say Ferocious like that. Mm, do Feroz. Mm, this attack is uh, Shoto. Uh, 
it's a uh, hado you know, just like that see that's it that's all it takes that's really all it takes yeah. and I just fill this all up with all these uh, moves and arc drives so like puppeteer human so it'll be like puppeteer human uh oh I'm getting one of those uh, insert issues well anyway uh, well let's just uh, let's just uh, undo all that so it'll be something like that and then I just pull up the uh, let's see where are you at pull up the snippet tool I'll pull up the snipping tool and then I'll just snip it there we go and then I snip it and then just throw right on up uh, into the whole thing so yeah that's a uh, that's it, and then uh, that's how it works in a nutshell. There we go. That was a quickie. <laughs> that was a quickie. So, yeah, that's how fast. Uh, that's how easily I do it. Yep. Yep. It's not that. It's not that hard. Um, well, that's not true. Um, that's not true. It could get very hard um, the more complicated the, the game is. Um, a Carnal Heart 3, Love Max, I had to make two sets of, um, of move sets. One for uh, for a Heart I Know and one for Potatinas. So that took a very long time because that was a lot of moves uh, to write down. Mm. The easiest one was, oddly enough, it was uh, uh, Fighting Jokes because they don't have a move list. I mean, well, they have a move list, but they don't tell you the name of the moves, and and the, and the characters only had like maybe a couple of moves, and that's it. So, uh, let's see here. So, let me let me get this. Where's my move list? Ah, here we go. Move list. So I had to create a separate uh, move list X. Uh, let me see where's move list X. Here we go. So like I had to uh, build uh, do move list decks here, so that way it can uh, switch out the um, the fighters. See like that, and it switches out like that when there's too much. So it has the so it switch uh, moves around. So I got um, I got the fists for uh, Street Fighter, and then I got the uh, the letters for uh, uh, for anime style fighting games. So that's pretty much uh, that's pretty much all to it. Uh, depends on on how easy the the move list is. The hardest one of them all is um, late strangers because their whole entire system. Um, I had to I had to create. A, I had to create a um, what you call it uh, an assist here. Where are we at? Where we at? Where we at? Mm. Ah, here we are. Yeah, here we go. go. Perfect example. Here's a quote. As you can see, um, because uh, Blade Strangers, um, so you see how um, in in uh, Under Night Ember, Melty Blood, A is light attack, B is uh, B is medium attack, C is uh, is um, uh, heavy attack, and then you got the special button with uh, with. Blade Strangers, they only have light and, he and heavy, and then you got the uh, unique and special. Uh, they so there's no medium attack, so it was very difficult to line up A, B, and C like I would with uh, with Melty Blood. So I had to create this button guide, uh, so everybody, so y'all know what uh, what buttons I'm using in relation to uh, to the game and. The directions that they go which is primarily uh, smash Brothers style um controls anyway you know forward down up and all that stuff but it um but i had to improvise and do a button guide for for this game um so that way it could be uh you all know exactly what they correspond to and that's basically and that was and this is technically my um my setup for for my fight stick on um, blade strangers so yeah it, the more uh, the more complicated the controls, the more harder um, it gets. Uh, here we go. Here's uh, here's hard I know. 
This was um, this was a kind of heart. Um, in fact, let me go into move list X here. Let me bring up the move list X so you can see what uh, so I can show you what that was like I'm trying to um, do a kind of heart three. That's why I haven't really done a kind of heart uh, anymore. A kind of heart games because it takes a long time uh, to set all that up. Well, that and also I gotta do a lot of training on that game because <laughs> I only know heart I know in um, and uh, what's her name, the one with the uh, Orcalcos, the, the maid, the giant sword. I forgot her name. Uh, where's Pete? Where's Pete? Where's Pete? Ah, here we go. Partinis. Here we go. So yeah, look at all the um, all of that. Uh, yeah, I'll just move this up here. So, so there's Partinius, um, Hartsa uh, Akana. So that's a whole lot of uh, <laughs> that's a whole lot of uh, um, commands. So I do want to I do want to do Akana Heart Three, although although it looks like. A, um, looks like a kind of heart three has a, uh, um, an updated version on Steam, so I'm, I probably might consider going for that. Um, because I have the because this is on PlayStation three, a kind of heart three love max, um, my, uh, my version. So, yeah, this is uh, <laughs> this is how far uh, above and beyond I go for for these um, for this show. <laughs> Yes, it is a lot of moves. It's a lot to remember because you gotta. Um, because what happens is that you have to activate um, your arcana, and then you get access to all these moves on top of uh, on top of your um, 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 current moves. So it's like an install kind of thing. It's an install uh, function. So, or B trigger if you wanna if you wanna go there. <laughs> okay. So yeah, this is uh, this is basically how I do the um, the move lists. Uh, it's very simple, uh, very quick. Uh, if you set, if you set yourself up right and everything, and um, you got yourself a, a kick-ass stream. <laughs> I'm moving everything around. I'm destroying the illusions. Here we go. Now let me go back to I'll go. Mm. Let's see. Oh. Huh. Yeah, this is a funny one. Yeah, no, you, um, you, no, thank you for asking. I'm very glad that I get a chance. I, uh, I got a chance to show some behind-the-scenes stuff. You know, it's not every day uh, um, I get to do that. Get give all you guys insight into what goes behind here uh, in the wonderful world of Koki-san. Uh, where did I put? She's under A. There we go. Put, uh, there we go. You know, you know, never, never hesitate to ask questions. I'm always, always happy to give some kind of behind-the-scenes stuff. There we go. I don't even have the size right. Oh well. And eh, what am I worried about? Everything. I'm worried about everything. Presentation is always good. <laughs> yeah. There we go. That's a little better. Just one inch to the right, and there we go. Hey, there we go. And try to line it up nice, uh, nice and uh, tidy, so that when I switch out, it looks consistent. Anyway, uh, let me put my face back up here. So, yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Mm. I feel like we're lacking people. <laughs> Reptile left? Mm -hmm. well, he left. Thanks for coming by, Reptar. Don't be a stranger. Don't be a stranger. <laughs> uh, Alright. So, let me get out of this. Here we go. Have some nice music in the background. Not some crazy rockin' hardcore stuff. <laughs> we saved that for the awesomeness. <laughs> mm. 
Uh, so next week, let's see. What am I? Mm, I guess. Uh, I guess I'll come back to go back to Under Night and Bird. I haven't jumped into that uh, in quite some time. Uh, I still haven't decided yet uh, if I want to put up a list of um, all previous roster runs for um, for each uh, for each game. Fight games, yes. <laughs> mm. So I think I'm gonna do I'm um, gonna do that because um, uh, I'm worried about spoiling. But like I said, you know the roster runs are very long videos, and I guess I could leave that up to the uh, to the um, to the viewer if they want to watch the whole thing or not. But I guess uh, but I do want uh, I do want to have a list out so uh, so everybody can keep track. All viewers can keep track of uh, my progress. Also good for me because I gotta try and remember. Who, uh, who I've been playing <laughs> I don't want to uh, um, I don't want to jump into a, into a, a, um, a repeat run yet um, I don't think I'm ready to jump back to the same players because mm. uh, I only did it twice one with King and King of Fighters 13 and one with Arquid 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 I still can't pronounce her name Arquid here in, in here in Melty Blood <laughs> Arc, arc. Ah, somebody's gonna scream at me. I know somebody's gonna scream at me. <laughs> Eventually, they'll scream at me. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm gonna jump into Under Night. It's a funny name. It is a funny name. I mean, I think they were trying to go for Alucard, but they, but they just added in those extra vowels and just made it. <laughs> yeah, King, King, King was my best. King, uh, King. In King of Fighters 13 was was my most excellent run. Um, I kind of like surprised myself when I played that. Um, I had to do it a second time because I felt denied, and then I realized that my roster was not um, that my whole roster was not complete, and I was and that there was some DLC. And I don't even know if I could be able to get the DLC off PSN now because PlayStation 3 PSN um, I guess shut down or something uh, or is limited. So, so I don't know if I'll be able to get the. Uh, get those DLC characters for a complete roster. So, and now we're up to King of Fighters 15, and I'd rather, and I feel like I'd rather go to that uh, more than anything. I'm sure King is there. <laughs> uh, yeah. The menus are weird in the PS3 store. It's uh, PS3 store is definitely hard to navigate. It's very hard to navigate. How I managed to get those um, all those uh, anime style games is beyond me. <laughs> navigate and pull out all those uh, all those video games back then uh, with with only the controller. I didn't even have the the little um, uh, uh, that attachment with uh, the keypad attachment that comes with it. Yeah. Oh yeah. But, man, but it, it, I, I don't know. I mean, I mean, I skip. I'm skipping 14 altogether because 15 right now is uh, is pretty big. Oh, okay. They made the purchase button invisible, but you can still select it. All right, that's good to know. That's good to know. I'm just not sure if I'm ready to update. <laughs> I'm wor uh, uh My PS3, my my pre. Teeny, love me some KOF. Yes, I really want to get back into KOF. Honestly, I want to get back to a lot of things. <laughs> I want to get back to a lot of games, a lot of fighting games. It's it's insane. It's insane. But yeah, I do want to get to KOF, uh, KOF 15 really, because that looks uh, a lot of fun. Um, <laughs> it's a, it's, um, it's definitely, uh, definitely looks like a lot of fun. Um, very well modernized uh, from what I've, uh, from what I've been seeing in the videos. And as long as it's got King, King's my main. <laughs> King, my, King's, my, King is my main. I love her. I love her. Then I'm strike. Then I'm strike. <laughs> mm. 
And I'm only saying that because I had a most excellent uh, roster run with her. <laughs> now I've always played her from 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 the very from from since the old days. So I've never never really dropped her for any reason. She's no matter who I play, I, she's always in in the team. So yeah, I gotta get to I gotta grab that. I gotta get my hands on uh, Guilty Gear Strive and start roster running that. Um, that one, that one, that one is one of the most roughest roster runs uh, that I go through, that I've gone through is, uh, is the Guilty Gear games, playing it at the maximum settings. It was a miracle that I was able to pull off some wins with Iron Tager and, and uh, it's all bad guy, but those that AI, oh man, I can't imagine Strive and the torture I'm going to put myself through. Oh, that's right. Evo is this weekend. Oh, 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 oh dang. I gotta, I, I gotta remember. I gotta, gotta remember the dates. Street Fighter Five is still going up, right? Well, yeah, that, oh, is DNF Duel going to be on, uh, be at Evo? I want to see that. I want to see that. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. that's a, that's, a, that's another game that I'm dying to grab, um, get my, get my hands on off the steam. I gotta wait for the budget to, to be a little bit more solid uh, before I could get the these fighting games down. Um, but DNF Duel, I mean, wow, that's that's one heck of a no, no DNF ah. You're right. They do do a sale. Um, oh man, I'm probably gonna forget. I gotta make a note of this somewhere. <laughs> no, I'll worry about the noting. Hey, Grand Blue. Grand Blue's getting a shot. Gotta try. Um, I hope they gonna. I hope they air that on. Uh, I hope they air it. I wanna. Ch I wanna watch. Uh, I'll watch some of that. Oh man, so. Yeah, I'm gonna have to jump into the Steam this weekend and see um, how many if there's all uh, all these sales going on, and uh, see if I can snatch them up. Because then, um, then I'll have a nice, uh, nice set of shows to do deep dives and explorations. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Yeah, man. Um, wow, wow! What a what a year for fighting games. Honestly, this is a good year for fighting games. Got all kinds of new goodies, and then got the Capcom Fighting Collection. Um, I definitely want to go into that. I want to um, not so much uh, not so much play uh, specific games. I want to deep dive on that special button. Um, I took a quick look. I took a took quick look at that special button, uh, the special button that apparently is a, a sample serving of what's going to probably be, become a Street Fighter standard once six comes out. So I want to actually do a deep dive on that and see how that the, how it works. See see what uh, try and get an understanding of where Capcom is coming uh, is is coming from their their angle with the with the special button. Cause I, cause you know it's very polarized. I've I've, I've seen a lot of complaints on YouTube, uh, a lot of criticisms about it, and I think a proper deep dive into that special button would uh, would help out understanding what's going through Capcom's brain there uh, with this uh, with this special button and uh, the 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 uh, modern mode they call it <laughs> the modern mode. I mean, t it, it exists in, um, if I recall correctly, is that not in, yeah, I think that's the fighting EDX layer. I think that's the fighting EX layer. Yeah, the simple, uh, simplified modern mode. You can switch out from doing um, motion controls to simplify mode in, in uh, fighting EX layer, but it seems like Capcom is taking it to, is, L is taking it to, a ne to the next level from um, EX layer. So I would like to see, uh, Try and get an understanding of where they're going with it, because it feels like 
It feels like they've taken a cue from Smash Brothers. Considering that they uh, they had Ryu and Ken in Smash Brothers Ultimate, and something, uh, and, and it feels like they may have been inspired by it, and and they want to build on that, which is interesting. But I don't know. Uh, I don't know how I feel yet until I can actually really uh, test it out, um, really deep dive into it. Because uh, yeah, Venom Fang says I haven't looked too much into that, but it would be something to check out. Yeah, I think I think a proper uh, a proper show, uh, deep diving into into that uh, modern mode uh, would be uh, would be appropriate. Because uh, if that's gonna be because if that's gonna be the future of Street Fighter or fighting games in general, and it's you know now's the time to start understanding it uh, from a game design perspective. Uh, especially me being a game designer, <laughs> uh, me being a game designer, to try and get a good firm understanding and see uh, and see what that could benefit for for my game, Savage Strikers. You know, uh, if it's something that I can try to uh, contextualize in the cards, into the cards and such, so that'll be an interesting thing. Uh, that'll be an interesting thing. That'll mean that. Wow. Wow. Yeah, my brain, my brain is going uh, in a multiple, multitude of directions there. Mm. But yeah, yeah. I'm actually surprised. Uh, well, I don't know. Maybe I. Uh, you know what? I haven't. Uh, I've actually been looking up on YouTube to see if anybody deep dived into that. Oh well. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Self exploration. And you're in for the ride, Venom Fang. You are in for the ride. <laughs> mm. Let me decide. Let me pick. Uh, let's see. Who do I want to? Oh, have I done hide yet for uh, Under Night Inver? Yeah, right. I did. I did hide. Yeah. Um, hold on a second. Uh, I could tell very easily. Um, for next week's uh, roster run. Do -do 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 -do. Let's see. Have I done? Yeah, I did do hide. So who haven't I? Well, I've only I only done Lene hide, Yakia, uh, Yuzuriha. Mm. Hmm. Who do I want for my fifth my fifth roster my fifth roster on the Rainbow? Um, do you have do you have a pick, Ben and Thang, <laughs> for Undernight in Birth X Lake Clear? I'll take a I'll take a request from you uh, if you have a fighter in mind. Hmm. Mercava? Alright, we'll do a Mercava. That'll be the next roster run. Mercava. Gonna be the next roster run. Merkaba. Merkaba. Hmm. Merkaba. See how far I can go with Merkaba. I'm gonna have to do some training, no doubt. Hmm. 
I say this is good background music. <laughs> so, next week will be Under Night in Birth, X Lake Clear, Merkaba Roster Run. Uh, let's see. And then following, uh, and then uh, two Mondays uh, from now will be a uh, deep dive into Toho Hyoibana and Tenami uh, Flowers, where the, where the sakura petals blossom. <laughs> I just love the poetic sound of that name. And Tenami of Flowers, as the sakura, uh, as the sakura petals fall. <laughs> and then I'm going to do the, um, the special button deep dive uh, um, in three weeks, so... That's the next three, uh, the next three shows. Um, so we're gonna have a busy time. We're gonna have a fun time. We're gonna learn something. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Well, that's it for the show today, everybody. With all that said, I thank you all for joining me. I hope you all had a great time. I hope you all enjoy hanging out with me, listening. Uh, uh, I guess. Um, you know, Phantom Fang, you know what? Phantom Fang, I've had, maybe maybe you can uh, maybe you could uh, answer this question for me. Oh yeah, have a good one. Yeah. Uh, oh thank you, thank you. I shall have a good one. I shall have a good one day. <laughs> I shall have a good one. But here's my question. This is something that's been bugging me. Uh, this has been bugging me for a long time. Um uh, Saying hit the like button or or smash the subscribe button, I'm uh I'm not uh, it kind of weirds me out every time I say uh, say it. Uh, I'm just wondering if that's normal. If that's if that's like I don't know, good thing, you know, because well, given my upbringing, you know, you know, the it, it, uh, it feels like I'm begging. Uh, from a personal, from a personal perspective, it feels like I'm begging uh, for smash, uh, for like buttons and, and subscribe buttons. But I don't know if, uh, if that's perfectly normal. If that's a okay. Just it just seems weird uh, you know, for me to say it and such, you know, because I like I'm the type of person that likes to earn uh, and not come off like desperate or something, <laughs> like needy. I mean, I've been trying to figure out ways to say it, but you know. Mm. You know, but you know, YouTube videos be like, uh, be like, you gotta say it, you gotta say it. It's like, I'm sure people know how to do that on their own without having to be told. But I don't know. They keep insisting it's gotta be done. So I'm not sure. I mean, I'm that's just, I'm just looking for some thoughts on that. If, if, if I should just do it or not. Venom Fang says, I feel the same way. Not used to saying it as well, but in order to build, you gotta sell a bit. At the end of my streams, I just say, if you enjoyed what you saw, consider subbing, but you hanging out is the best part, which is the honest truth. Thanks, man. I'm glad to uh, know that I'm not alone on this. And yeah, I do feel that way too, man. I just like people hanging out, you know? It's, it's, you know, people coming by and, and chilling, and watch me go, go at it, you know? So okay, I mean, I'm sure I'm sure a lot more others uh, feel uh, feel uh, have the same sentiment as uh, as both of us. So most definitely, most definitely, you know, thank you all. We thank you all. You know, please uh, please uh, sub, subscribe. Um, you know, consider it, consider it. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, because it gets lonely out here. I mean, I'm I'm not gonna deny it, uh, deny this. Uh, I do I do feel lonely um, on these live streams, 
you know, but uh, <laughs> so you know, it does feel lonely. But it's great to um, have people popping in from time to time, even if it's briefly. Even if you guys uh, pop in briefly, you know, what I'm saying it, uh, it, it makes the stream uh, more more happier and, and fun. So you know, so yeah, yeah, you know, don't hesitate, don't hesitate. And always remember hanging out. I always remember to hang out. Is the is the fun part? I don't know. I'll figure. I'll figure out a phrase. <laughs> I'll figure out. I'll figure out a line. I'll figure out a line. <laughs> thank you very much, Fen and Fang. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, everybody. <laughs> With that said, um, I'll see y'all next week or. For some of you who want the Japanese stream, see y'all Wednesday. For those of you who love fighting, I'll see y'all Monday. Uh, so, y'all have a good night. Buenas noches. And, oh, you see me in the site. <laughs>